For Steven Kotorobles, this all started back in 2021 in his own kitchen, but now they're here at Catalina United Methodist Church, and today they're joined by some very special volunteers. We're not destined to just live with hungry kids in our society forever. The Tucson Roadrunners skated off the ice and into the kitchen to help out the Tucson Family Food Project. And anytime you get to come out in the community and give back like this, you always try to have fun with it because it's for a bigger cause. The Tucson Family Food Project helps kids with food insecurities by giving them meal kits that they can make themselves at home. When you give them just a meal and it's like, here's your meal for you to eat, when they're done eating it, it's over. You know, that thing you've given them is gone. So we're trying to give them something that they can take with them beyond a meal. Each week there is a different meal. This week is a maple walnut granola. It's a small deed, but it goes a long way, so it's uh, something nice to do for the community. The project is currently in four schools across Tucson and feeding 200 families. We deliver to them on Friday, so that way we can make sure that they have food for the weekend because so many kids use school as their primary source of nutrition. Coda Robles hopes in the coming year the project can grow to 400 families. This is an actual fixable problem and the results we're seeing from this totally unique approach to fighting childhood food insecurity has just been enormous. Their meals range all the way from the maple walnut granola like they made today to a potato brussels and herbs frittata. I saw a picture of it earlier and it looked pretty good. At Catalina United Methodist Church, Aaron Patterson, KGUN 9.